Hello, my name is Professor Rory Ridley Duff, and in this video, I'm going to show you how and when to do an initial social audit to help you fill out your fair shares canvas. Before we begin using the social auditing tool, I just want to explain the logics of enterprise development when you're doing fair shares social auditing. Firstly, I need to open fairshares.coop forward slash social audit and show you the four auditing tools. We've already had a look at the social enterprise value survey. Below that, you will see initial social audit, initial participation audit, and initial governance audit. All of these help you with the process of filling out a fair shares canvas to develop or audit the practices of your enterprise's members. So let me quickly open the fair shares canvas to mention some key points. The Fair Shares Canvas is filled out slowly over a period of time. As you fill it out, you work out answers to questions about the relevance of your enterprise, the feasibility of your enterprise, and then how to sustain your enterprise. For each set of questions, we suggest that you hold different workshops related to each stage and set of questions. On our courses, we teach you how to run an ideas workshop, an incubation workshop, and then a planning workshop. The initial social audit is a way of gathering information from your enterprise members online, perhaps because they cannot attend a face-to-face -face workshop. The answers they give help you craft answers that you will input into a Fair Shares Canvas. So let's start. I'll go to the social audit page and click on the initial social audit option. On the social audit survey page, you will see the academic article and project report that has informed the development of the initial social auditing tool. Let's start the survey. Like the other auditing tools, you need to input your email address and accept the Creative Commons license terms. You'll see a diagram that has six key questions on it. As you do the initial social audit, you will answer a series of questions that relate back to one or more of the six key questions. Answering each question helps you to think about the enterprise development process. I'm going to choose trial for this demonstration in order to bypass the collection of biographical information. All the questions are open questions. Each person can fill out the social audit to give their own answers. You can leave questions blank if you're not sure what to answer. What's the idea behind your enterprise? So you put your answer in. What need does your idea fulfil? I'll answer the need that the Fair Shares Association is seeking to fulfil. How does your idea create opportunities to share wealth and power? This is Fair Shares Principle 1. What makes your idea attractive to founders, workers, users, and if appropriate, external investors? These are the four primary stakeholders in a Fair Shares enterprise. On the next page, we move on to questions about feasibility. I'll go through these quickly. Firstly, how would you describe the four primary stakeholders? Secondly, how can your primary stakeholders cooperate to create a supply chain? These are all the people involved on the production side of the enterprise. Thirdly, what will you produce? Lastly, what resources will you need and which of the six forms of wealth will you use up? These questions test out your thinking on the feasibility of your idea. The last page of the initial audit is about reaching the people who need your goods and services. So how will you segment your clients or your customers? Also, how will you distribute your goods and services? Importantly, how will you evaluate the impact of providing those goods and services? And lastly, what wealth do you think the distribution of goods and services will create? When you have answered all the questions you can think to answer, 
you can go to the submission page. All of our Fair Shares social auditing tools and diagnostics are available on the Fair Shares Association website. That's okay if you want to try them out and perhaps use them with students in a classroom setting. But if you want to do social auditing in a single organisation or in consultancy work, you'll need your own set of personal survey tools that you can customise. We provide these to members and people who have an annual subscription to the Fair Shares Association. If you go to fairshares.coop forward slash membership, you can apply for a subscription or for membership, and then we can provide you with your own set of tools. Audio jungle. Audio jungle. I hope you found that video useful. Uh, we have courses available on the website of the Fair Shares Institute. If you want to study to become a certified practitioner in Fair Shares, point your browser at fsi.coop forward slash courses to find out more information.